What is up, party people? It's Justin Langua, Sterling Properties. Coming at you with video number, uh, I've lost track. I've, lost, I've got it up to Reed Bennett. He's gonna give me the, uh, the ticker in the comments below. I uh, wanna to talk to you guys about dry powder. So this is something that, um, if you've not heard of the phrase before, some cool cat probably on the West Coast invented it uh, several decades ago. Right now we're seeing investors, large investors, institutions with a ton of dry powder that's just sitting on the sidelines. That means they are uh, they're ready to roll, they're ready to party. They've got what they need to actually buy deals. Uh, the biggest problem that they're running into is a lack of deals. So for those that are sitting on pristine assets, really, really good investment opportunities, most, most have nothing to trade into. So we've got a, a bit of a, a quagmire in that there's not a, a lot of stock, there's not a lot of inventory out there to buy, but we're seeing pent up demand from uh, investment groups that are looking to, to kind of part ways with their money and put it to work. So we've, we've heard a lot about 1031 activity, uh, we were, you know, we thought with this July 15th deadline that was, um, you know, last month, we'd see a tremendous amount of activity. Well, we had a ton of conversations with 1031 buyers, but everything that we put under contract after July 15th was, was not with the 1031 buyer. So not sure what's going on. There's something in the air. I know there's a lot of dry powder sitting on the sidelines waiting to get uh, put to use, but right now, I think it's just kind of a waiting game. So let me know what's happening in your worlds. Again, stay safe. Peace.